Welcome to the jungle. Let's take a journey and explore this endlessly sprawling natural wonderland. Or we could see what's going on here. <laughs> Give it up, monkey man! You'll never catch me! George used turbo vine! There's no such thing! Shh, no listen. That's why he bad, doctor. <laughs> Laser razor! Who eats dirt? Oh, it's over for us. Uh, hi, Ursula. Sorry for waking. Doctor, what Ursula just eat? No, I carry a lot of stuff, okay? Ah! Oh, so that's what it was. She ate my erupto link! Ah! Ah! Uh, what it do? It lets you use the volcano as a weapon, you idiot! Okay, no problem, no problem. George, just pull it out. Ah! What we do now? Ah! Ah! Um, George, not sure if Ursula catch what doctors say, but if Ursula tries to stay calm, it'd be big help to George. Ape ah! <laughs> know what to do. Abandoned jungle. Abandoned jungle. <laughs> You're right. You're right. Okay, let's think about this. Until we figure out how to get the remote control out of Ursula, we must keep her calm. George agree. <laughs> so George invite Ursula for calm dinner party. George! What? George no see problem. <laughs> George see problem. No! <laughs> Oh, Ursula hate food. She no pronounce. Horse nerves? No, no nerves. It's French. They're just mini sandwiches. Mini sandwiches. French? Now you sad like Ursula's dummy with no food in it. <laughs> no hurry. George brings salad. <laughs> Ursula, help self. We need to try something else. Uh, I have perfect idea to keep Ursula not mad. Yeah. <laughs> so, George, visualize punching bag as source of frustration. Hey, tree. Why you be in George's way all time? What George ever do to you, tree? <laughs> See? Visualize. No, wait, Ursula! George not! You write this 
<laughs> George, we're running out of options. George, see? <laughs> We've tried reasoning with <laughs> Ursula, but that <laughs> hasn't worked. There's only one <laughs> option. Send her to space? Okay, there's two options. <clears throat> About time Jungle apologized to Ursula. Excellent. Now, George. George? Help! Help! You hid in the cake, didn't you? Hmm. Oh, it'll come out. Everything comes out. Eventually. We need to get that remote control out of Ursula. We know can wait for eventually. She hot lava angry all the time. Well, here's your problem. She set on Grouchy. Ah! What? Her emotion switch. It's on mad. Ah, George understand. George no understand. This'll clear things up. I'll add it to your bill. I'm Groovy Gorilla, here to give you the lowdown about that switch on your back. First, you have a switch on your back. Second, you have a switch on your back. Even me? Even you, Tommy. Even George, weird gorilla? It's a film, George. Even you, George. Psst, that crazy. <laughs> George and Ape no have switches on back. The most important thing about these switches is you must never, ever tamper with them. If you do, peace out. George, I don't know about this. George not know about most things. <laughs> Best pal, George! Best friend, Ape! Ursula loves everyone! Once again, George fix everything. That's novel. <laughs> Ursula, go make up for lost odds. Hello, <laughs> Mr. Lion. That weird. The volcano isn't spewing lava. It's spewing some kind of rainbow love. Ah, uh. lava. Best name Ape could think up. Might be okay. Jungle be friendlier place. Up top, eight eyes. Well, it's not the first time we've played God. There! George, make new animal! George, I don't often say this, but you are absolutely right to flip Ursula's switch. Aw, oh, Ape. No, I mean it, George. I had my misgivings about the plan, but... Ape! And as Aristotle once said... Ape! So, in conclusion... Ape! George, you were wrong to flip Ursula's switch. So very wrong. This is worse than the lava. Hey, right. George fixed this once already, so George fix it again. Hug for George? <laughs> so? George believe Abe say something earlier about panic? Indeed. <laughs> George have one last idea, but it mean George go into dark place. Anyone? Ursula ready for more hugs now? Hello? Why jungle no one hugs? George want hugs? No. What? No, thank you. But Ursula give good hugs. No hugs for George, okay? You get hugged now. 
No want Ursula stinky hug. Stinky hug? Yeah, Ursula hugs all stinky. That why animals climb into ball and try to get away. Tell her, Abe. Um, I neither would like your malodorous embrace. Your hugs are smelly and dumb. <laughs> Again, George solved problem. Uh, hi, Ursula. <laughs> Sorry for changing Ursula personality. Forgive? <laughs> to live in the jungle. You must be cunning. <laughs> Quick witted. <laughs> and very, very smart. <laughs> or not. Have you noticed that Tuki has been acting strangely lately? Uh huh. Tuki, <laughs> Tuki. It's simple. Your Tootie Bird is full of evil spirits. Luckily for you, I just had my evil spirits horn tuned up. Uh. <laughs> ah. George, Tookie Tookie Bird is suffering from a complex gastrointestinal bloating disorder. Uh -huh. <coughs> he has gas. Evil spirits! <laughs> Evil spirit! Yes! You started Bagpipes Day without me? No, we're curing Tookie of evil gas spirits. Boys, there's nothing wrong with Tuki Tuki. He's in love. Ah. With her. Ooh, ooh. Huh? What do you mean? Uh. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you mean little Tuki? <laughs> Is in love. <laughs> Tuki. Ooh, ooh. Who could ever fall in love with a girl? George doesn't get it. I'm already your pal. What do you need a girl for? <laughs> this new girl thing is gonna wreck our whole guy, ape, bird, two girls, and elephant thing. It's love, George. And it makes people do the most wonderful things, like getting makeovers. Ha! Tookie doesn't want a haircut. That's so funny, George will laugh right now. Ha! Ha ha ha! Ha 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 ha! That's the one. It's perfect. Ah. Ooh, 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 ooh. Now, if you want her to notice you, you need to give her something to remember you by. Uh, something a girl would really like. Uh, a fluffy kitten that never grows big, and its pink nose doubles as a pot of lip gloss. I was thinking more like a worm. Give her this. George of the jungle, I'm surprised at you. <laughs> You're Tukey's best friend. Why aren't you being helpful? 
everybody act normal. I found out that it's the natural behavior of the oo bird to select her mate based on who builds the strongest nest. So if Tuki builds a strong nest, he's got a chance with her? Right. Hey, uh, whose side is Ape on? Well, I'm on the side of nature, and in nature, you just have to go with whatever happens naturally. Okay, Tuki. Big nest, okay? See? You build. Ah! Uh, help? trial nest. Why, he's building the biggest nest this jungle's ever seen. George, I'm really proud of you. I love it! Once George had a plan, it was easy. Right, Ape? And Ape? Close the glass door! <laughs> Be in the tree. <laughs> Ready, everyone? <laughs> Ready up here. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> silly me. That's, uh, that's, that's, that's good there. George saw two coconuts sitting together on the ground ones. They looked happy. George, I'm talking about real love. Look at Tookie Tookie. He is so happy, so in love, so blissful, so... <laughs> Leaving? Tookie, what's wrong? Why is Tookie hiding? Tookie wants a girlfriend, right? To wreck all our good times, right? Tookie, Tookie! George doesn't get it. George, it turns out that whoever the oo bird chooses for a mate, the other oo birds attack it to see if it can defend itself. Hmm. George! Uh-oh. No. Uh-oh. Ooh, ooh! Oh, uh-oh, ooh, ooh, yeah. <laughs> George! 
Good idea! Ooh, ooh. I just wanted to tell you what a sweet thing you did. Okay, okay. Help! Close the garage door! <laughs> George. In case you're new around here, George is king of the jungle. It's really more of an honorary title. George may be king, but it's not like the other animals actually, you know, listen to him. Waterfall down. So to go up, just go in back first. <laughs> Tickle. His ideas about how the world works are completely weirdo bizarre, to say the least. That's not called moon. That's Steve up there! <laughs> Hi, Steve! Hey, Steve! Hi, Steve! Steve! You want honey? Just squeeze out a honey badger! Where else honey come from? Flower? Bee? <laughs> Ridiculous! <laughs> Here, George, show you! <laughs> Bad news! He out of honey! None of the animals in the jungle take George's ideas seriously. Can you blame them? Remember that vital piece of information, because today we're following, wait for it, Dr. Chicago. Bet you didn't see that coming, huh? Cuspid, where are you? Uh, I thought I was right here, but now I'm confused. Quiet, I have a new plan, and it's totally boss. I feel it in my evil bones. Your evil bones? We should call a doctor. It's a figure of speech, and I'm a doctor, you molar. As I was proclaiming, this plan will work perfectly. Unlike my weather machine plan. Beautiful day out. George, agree. <laughs> oh, my diabolical plan to enslave the jungle using a legion of battle snails. Hurry up! Ah, today, please! Or my most fiendish plan of all, the nano tachyon underpants itcher. Have some itch in your git! <laughs> Uh, me no wear underpants. <laughs> but this time, instead of picking on someone my own size, I shall pick on someone much smaller than that. I hereby declare myself supreme ruler of this jungle daycare. Kneel before Chicago. Five minutes later... Aren't you just the fuzzy wuzziest? Yes, you are! OMG! I've never seen such adorable hyenas! <laughs> Ow! <laughs> Ow! <laughs> Why, hello, widow baby bonobo! Aren't you precious and huggable and snuggle-huggable? Wait! What am I saying? Something about wuzzies and fuggies and super snuggle wuggle fuggles. Ah, they hypnotized me. Me, these mewling, mangy, adorable little cuddle kittens. Ah, help me! Their big eyes and chubby cheeks have more power than a quad laser! In fact, they've given me a cuddly, wuddly, evilly brainwave. Yes! Yes! I've done it! Yay! Done what? Behold! My most villainous creation! The Mascara of Infinite Cuteness! Observe, you laughable stooge! Ew! Cuspid, I'd be super duper happy if you hit yourself with that frying pan! 
Anything for you, Mr. Lovable. Are you there? Once I have this mascara to myself, no one will be able to resist my ridiculously cute but evil demands. Oh, hello. We're here to put an end to your sinister robot crocodile plan. What? You idiots spoiled that last week. Oh, okay. No need to get all mean about it. Hmm, how about... Can we get a jump on foiling your eye-popping machine? No, I gave up on that. I was a fool to think I could get it on a cartoon. But since you're here... Cusp it! Apply my mascara! George! <laughs> hey, uh, watch out! Uh, uh, necessary? That was expensive! No! You caused a chain reaction! George? George! Are you okay? Oh, George feel like bruised banana. One bruised banana, you darling little Georgie Wargy. Wow, ape no French? Hours later, in pretty much the same spot. What? Cuspid, where are... Uh, I'm awake, stop! Where's my mascara of infinite cuteness? Kablooey all over George's face. That flea-bitten jungle cretin stole my mascara? I'll show him who's in charge. Uh. <laughs> Holy cannoli! What's going on? Oh, it's George. He's so cute that everyone does whatever he says. Only out for an hour. What is that? Oh, that's the Snake Space Program. George said they should start it since Snake and Space are spelt the same. Snake, you're not one. This is Mission Control. Is back thrusters. I can't. I have no hands. We also have no hands. Ah! Ape look good. Hi. Ah, uh, whatever you say, you snooky wookums. George like new nicknames. Oh. I could just eat you up with a side of sprinkles. You're so precious. Magnolia good at burrowing. Magnolia should try living with mole rats. Oh, anything you say, little Georgie. Cuspid, can your feeble mind grasp the worst part of all this? Um. George stole your invention! He stole my invention! Sorry, yes, you were right. Come, I have a plan! <laughs> this cutie shot will inoculate us from George's quantum adorability! <laughs> but, 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 Doctor, I'm, I'm afraid of the, 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 the needles! Ah, oh, that wasn't so bad. Don't be silly, that was the warm-up shot! <laughs> He's still kind of cute. Quiet. George won't be kind to anything thanks to my hair pistol. <laughs> Don't take me to Sari! Wake up. Let the jungle see how cute George is now with a dumb mustache. <laughs> no one with a handlebar mustache can be cute. No one, I say. <laughs> The next logical step is to use my orbital solar shield and block out the sun. How cute can something be if you can't even see it? <laughs> it's working. It's working. <laughs> that is it. If George wants war, then war he gets. You mean? Yes. I must science myself badly. I shall create a superior formula, the double mascara of infinite impossible cutie-odiness. Oh, my golly. Then use my ambition array to enlarge my features to saccharine proportions. So dangerous. And finally, the piece de resistance, a tiny sailor outfit. Mercy on us all. Let's dance, Sea Wets. Hey, 
jungle pants. I'm calling you out! Aww. George, I challenge you to a cute off! George not know what cute off is, or why bark only on outside of trees. But George no trust Dr. Chicago. Too bad! Cause I'm serving up a heap and herpin' of this! Aww. Let's see what you got. Sorry, George Itchy. What'd I miss? <gasps> Cuspid! It's not working and I blame you for no reason! Bring me the- No, Doc! It's too dangerous! The adorable Ixa! Now! It's the world's most super squeeable animal squeezed down into a single bottle! My last chance to crush George and take over my jungle! Cuspid, if I don't survive this, you were always a constant disappointment. Oh, thanks, Dad. I mean, Doc. I can have domination. Animals, help George up. What in the world? Let us never speak of this. Ugh, agreed. Uh, where's George? <laughs> George won't hug cutie booty booty dog first! Put me down, please! Please! 